Dave. Tell, Tell us a delightful, delightful story, story in your, your voiceover career. career. Oh, there have been so many. Well, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to mention this isn't <laughs> necessarily a delightful story. Um, I'll, I'll tell you about my first job, my first big national commercial. Uh, I, this is 1990. I come to Los Angeles to do voiceover. And uh, very quickly, I, I booked this job for the Big Red Boat. That's Disney's uh, cruise line. And I, they say, oh, they love your voice. Ah, they love the read, blah, 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 blah. I go in the studio. And, you know, you, when you're in the studio, it's a big L.A. studio. And you've got the writer and the producer and this person and that person. There's like six or seven people there. The engineer and me in the booth by myself. And uh, they give me the script, and I give it a few reads, and, you know, I think 15, 20 minutes, we're in and out of there, and they're just telling me, oh, man, we just love, oh, this is so good, we just love it, we love it, oh, you love your voice, oh, the deep, the rich tones, it's so beautiful. And I, I'm like, wow, okay, great, they're loving this, so when is this going to air? And uh, they told me, well, it's going to air on such and such a show, you know, it's about a week from now, blah, 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 blah. And so I, you know, mom, dad, <laughs> oh, man, big red boat, Disney, it's coming on. A, it's going to be on such and such a show. And I called all my friends uh, and I was there sitting on my television, you know, waiting for the spot to come on. It came on and it was somebody else's voice. It was what happened? Well, Somewhere up the food chain, somebody decided they wanted a different read on that. We want somebody else. We want a different sound. So they hired somebody else. Now, in many ways, uh, it, well, it was very painful at the time. Uh, but it was a huge lesson because uh, sometimes you're not going to book a thing or you're going to book it and then it's not going to happen. And it's not because you're not good. It's somebody was looking for something different. Uh, most of the booking decisions are made by committee. And although you may be somebody's first choice, um, you, somebody else wants somebody else. And, and sometimes you just don't get the gig. Don't think it's because you're not good. <laughs> 